It's new miner day. Oh, a new Bitcoin miner. I love it. Huge shout out to the team over at Advanced Crypto Services for sending me this brand new Bitax Touch. Let's get it unboxed. All right, moment of truth. I've seen a number of these units out there. Excited to get an early version of this. Let's open it up and see what's inside. It's actually a quote here. Chancellor on brink of second bailout for banks. The Bitcoin Genesis block, January 3rd, 2009. Oh man. All right, we have, look at this. This is like, oh, this is cool. This is like a QA test. That's actually really slick. I'm just gonna slide this to the side so I can show this here. This is actually pretty cool to see that like, hey, this has been tested because I'll be honest, we get a lot of stuff and it runs for like an hour or it's DOA. So this is actually really, really convenient. Look at that. Shows like serial number, BM1368. Uh, they actually do have a BM1370 model, I believe. We'll take a closer look here. Shows at uptime. Okay, this was after 10 minutes, which is great. This is cool. Well done, ACS. That is a very cool feature. Just to throw in a little piece of paper. All right, back to the good stuff. So here is our, wow, this is heavy. This is not cheap. Okay, we got to peel this off. The moment of truth. Oh, I can't even like get it off. Come on. Oh, I don't know. Let's see. Here we go. All right. Magic. Wow. Look at this. You can like see my, this is crazy shiny. Warning red panda mining. Do not do an unboxing with one of these units. Holy cow. So check this out. So it's got a fan on this side and a fan on that side. I wonder if I'm not seeing any like intake areas. So I'm wondering if one of these is intake and one of these is exhaust. Actually, my guess is intake and exhaust, but we'll have to test it out. That is a huge screen, by the way. Oh, they need like a hobbyist miner logo right here. This is, this is lost real estate. A little black hobbyist miner logo would look awesome right there. The bottom here. Looks like they have like some security screws again in the bottom. Here's your serial number. It says BM1368. Look at that, ACS Bit Axe Touch, BM1368, proudly made in Texas. That is awesome. Shout out to them being in the US. We have a USB type C, I'm not sure what that is. And then we have a power plug. Um, I wonder if this is an alternative way to power it. I'm not really sure, but that is slick. Okay, so boop, boop, boop. All right, let's get into this. So we got all different plugs in here based off of where you're located. Not sure on some of these. This one's kind of weird. It's kind of angled inward. Let's see what else we got in here. Okay, here we go. Plug. Oh, it's got ACS bit axe touch on the back. That's a nice little touch to it. All right, here we go. Plugged into our watt meter. Powering it up. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. Did you? It was there, I swear. It had a hobbyist miner logo on it. I didn't even know that they did that, the team at ACS. Oh, they need to do, I need to talk with them. All right, leave a comment. If we did a hobbyist minor edition, maybe like the hobbyist minor logo and theme and stuff, and like the hobbyist minor logo on the top here, like, what do you think? Would that be cool? Leave a comment down below, let me know. Okay, so welcome. Let me see if I can focus in here. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit more. There we go. That looks pretty good. A little, there we go, perfect. All right, let's get started. Begin setup, all right? So it's asking us for our wireless info. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in. Let's see, I'll be right back. All right, testing connection here. Let me just do that, there we go. Oh, it's asking me like what pool I wanna to mine to. All right, let's, we'll say, oh, okay. So it asked me what pool I wanna to mine to in my BTC address, but I can actually go to the QR code over here uh, it gives me the IP address of the miner after I connected to, to my wireless. Let me do setup later. See what this gets to. Oh, look at that. Okay. Dude, that looks so good. I like the hobbyist miner logo there. All right. Is it like boot loop or are we good? All right, cool. This is the main home screen container. Touch the container to cycle through the screens. All right. Oh, block height. That's cool. Is there another one? Maybe, oh, here, maybe over here. Nope, all right, we're giving it a minute. Use the left, oh, this is like a tutorial. Use the left tab to navigate 
touch tab to continue. Okay, it's kind of trying to teach me how nice of you. Status bar icon, tap the Wi-Fi symbol. All right, that's cool. It shows me like my IP address. I can scan the QR code to access everything. I like how it kind of like forces you through the tutorial. Scan the QR code and tap the screen to end the tutorial. Okay, cool. So we're all done there. Let's go up here. Oh, look at that. It shows you the Bitcoin price. Oh, that's nice. You can change it. Look at that. Canadian, Euro. That's convenient. Network hash rate, block height. Having countdown. That's sweet. Okay, current fees current fees per minute. All right. And what's this one? Network difficulty. Oh, I like the bar. That's pretty sweet. All right. So that's the home. Let's go to this one here. Oh, it shows us hashing. So it's on public pool right now. Um, and uh, it shows our hash rate 549. I think this does around 700. So we'll give it a little bit. Oh, there we go. Looks at the graph coming up. Dude, this thing would look so cool underneath my monitor on my desk. Okay. And oh, voltage, ASIC temp fan speed and uptime, and then settings. Okay, so we have Wi-Fi. We then can change our screen brightness. We have different presets, quiet mode, lower fan speed, balance mode, balance performance, or turbo mode. Ooh, I wanna see what turbo mode is. Let's do that one. Uh, theme. Oh, I can hear the fans going now. So we were definitely right. Uh, intake on this side and exhaust on this side. Look at the themes there. Hobbyist miner theme, I like that. And then there's a Bitaxe Red, a Solo Mining Co. And then the default, we're gonna keep it on the hobbyist there. Time, EST. All right, so let's hit save and save. All right, we'll give it a minute and let it uh, power. Dude, this is so nice. Guys, check this out. This is pretty dang slick. So like this dashboard is totally different. I'm actually really, really surprised by it, but it looks awesome. So let's go ahead and go through this a little bit. So right here, this is the dashboard. When you go to the IP address, real-time mining dashboard, it has your model top right, BM1368. It shows we're on the turbo preset, um, which we're at 0.96 terahash, and our uptime is just under three minutes. Uh, now, the nice thing is you do get a variety of different graphs on here. So they've done some work with this dashboard and interface, which is pretty slick. Now, if we go over to miners, it shows my bid axe right here um, that we have up and running, which is kind of nice, kind of searches your network. And I think this is kind of similar to like that swarm mechanic, I think that you have with um, some of the bid axe open firmware. Uh, look at that, it even shows your fan speed. That's actually kind of nice. Now under pool, I put mine on brains. Um, I like their solo pool and I have it set up over there. Uh, they have an analytics tab, which is kind of nice. That's kind of convenient. What's under power? Oh, it shows like the frequency settings and all of that. Thermals, that's pretty sweet. And oh, system info, that's nice. So we have logs, which looks good. Nothing wrong with it right now, which is great. Uh, and then we have Wi-Fi where we set up our Wi-Fi settings. Now, if we go to settings here, here is those three modes that we talked about. Um, traditionally, it's on balance mode, but we bumped it up to turbo mode. And if you click support, it actually goes over to advancedcryptoservices.com, ACS's website, which is really, really nice uh, that they have that built in with the firmware setup. So, oh, look at that. We just broke a terahash, which is awesome. 41C. I like that intake and exhaust design there. Now, I have mine over on Brains, as you guys can see here. If I search for my Bitcoin wallet address and hit open, let's see if it shows up on here yet. Not quite yet. Um, so it'll probably be another few more minutes before we see this over there. Now, if you guys want to check this unit out, you know, huge shout out to Advanced Crypto Services for sending it over to me. I'm going to link you this page. We do have a discount code to help you out. They have two different models, the silver and the midnight graphite. I think the midnight graphite would look really cool with a white hobbyist miner logo on top. Uh, you'll have to let me know your thoughts there. So price, the stock price, 275. Uh, ours is the silver one, actually, uh, which we have there. Uh, and you can run through this. I like how they have this like underneath of a monitor. I am actually thinking about putting this like at some point underneath of my monitor here, probably on the, uh, the quiet mode only because I do a lot of recordings and meetings just like this right here. Uh, but I like that they have this like right on your desk. I think this would look really sweet. Uh, I think we might have to do that. Oh, here it is, right? Check that out. They have it right underneath this monitor here, uh, which looks really, really good. So you can find all the details over here, all the specs. They actually have two models. 
the BM1368, and the BM1370. It's interesting, the BM1370 says 950 to 1 terahash, and then the normal mode, which is what we have for the BM1368, says 650 to 750. But we're we're doing pretty good right now. We're, we're right around 1 terahash, so like, maybe I have a unicorn here. Uh, I'm not sure. It looks like the watts are a little bit different between the two. The screen sizes are the same, so... Really, it's going to come down to just having the 1370 uh, chip in it, uh, which which definitely differentiate it. Now, if you decide to go ahead and buy this, you can use my code hobbyist, which will take it from 275 down to 255. So just use hobbyist at checkout if you're interested. Now, let's talk about how this model would do with solo mining, because this is a solo Bitcoin miner. You're not going to earn anything with it unless you hit a Bitcoin block. And it barely uses any watts as we showed there. So keep that in mind, we're like under 20 watts total. So this is meant to be a solo Bitcoin miner, which means you will not get paid anything unless you hit a Bitcoin block. But the nice thing is Bitcoin block right now is winning $371,000, which is absolutely wild. So if we come up here, we're gonna put in, uh, we're about nine, what were we at? Nine, six, nine, seven. What were we at here? Nine, eight, all right, we'll put that in here. So. 0 0.98 and then you can hit um it shows you right in here what your chances are up top so you have oh there's more details nice you have a one in six million four hundred and eighty six thousand nine hundred and ninety five chance per day you're pretty much playing the lottery here people of hitting a bitcoin block one in seventeen thousand seven hundred seventy three per year so are you going to hit a bitcoin block with this probably not not today, not tomorrow, not next week, probably not next year. However, there's a chance. And keep that in mind for 255 bucks. It's a great desk piece. It shows Bitcoin's price. It's got some great hash rate information on it as well. A great talking piece. I like it because there's Bitcoin's price on it. So I'm probably going to leave it up on that screen on my desk, which I think will look really, really good. And there's a chance to hit a Bitcoin block, which is pretty, pretty sweet. Check it out. Tell me that doesn't look good right here on my desk. Oh, I love it. Let me go ahead and zoom in. There we go. And take a look. We can come in here. We can go ahead and it shows us our hash rate right now. I just powered it on. Look at that. Clock if you want it to be. And then you can come over here and you can go ahead and get the graph view. This thing is absolutely awesome. Listen, huge shout out to the team over at advanced crypto services. I love to see this. Guys, I'll put a link directly down below. Go follow it, use the discount code, nab yourself one if you're interested. It might not be as cool as mine with the hobbyist miner theme on the blue, reds, and the logo, but hey, if you'd love to see one, leave a comment down below. Maybe we can get ACS to go ahead and manufacture one just like this. All right, guys, take care.